Hi everyone, my name is Bharat Chandra. This is my clarinet. You can see that it's really just a long tube with a bell section on the end that actually comes off like this. This helps disperse the sound where you play and a mouthpiece section right here. This has a reed on it, which is what helps make the sound, what makes the vibration that comes out of the, the instrument. Let's take a close up look at the mouthpiece and reed. Look at this, this is the ligature, which holds the reed onto the mouthpiece, and here's the reed by itself. You can see it's like a piece of bamboo almost, a piece of cane that's very thin at the tip. It's been flattened on one side and carved on the other so that it vibrates wonderfully. The vibration goes through the mouthpiece where it's amplified through the rest of the instrument, giving the clarinet its unique sound. The clarinet itself is made of wood. It's been made of other things in its history, plastic and even metal, but Mostly, it's made of wood. You can see here are the holes which you cover with your fingers, along with all of these keys which reach even further up and down the instrument, covering and uncovering other holes, so that you can play all of the notes we have in music. If you didn't have these keys, you probably have to have a lot of extra fingers in order to play all the music that we can play. In the orchestra, the clarinet gets to do a little bit of everything. It gets to play slow, beautiful melodies, and it gets to play very exciting, fast passage work. Other times, it gets to just hide in the background and blend in with everything else that's going on. I enjoy all of that, and I especially enjoy getting to play with some of my best friends. Musicians are so much fun to be around, and playing the clarinet in the middle of the orchestra is really one of the best experiences I could ever have. I hope you like this excerpt and thanks for listening.